morning guys. So I'm up early this morning. It's about 6.30 in the morning. I'm going to meet up with my friend Henry to uh, go for an early morning shoot uh, around the woods. And just have a bit of fun. Uh, I've got my film camera today, so we're gonna play around with some film. It's gonna be cool. I uh, hope you look forward to it and stay tuned. So there's actually a few reasons why I don't like getting the bus. And one of them is uh, actually because if you wait the wrong side and uh, the bus goes straight by you on the other side, and that was the bus you're supposed to get, you gotta wait another half an hour. So, yeah, that just happened, and now I have to wait another half an hour. So, uh, just missed the sunrise and I'm not happy. But, uh, yeah, let's start this day on a good uh, note and uh, just carry on uh, with what we were planning to do. So, yeah. see that behind me there's a bit of orange and pink and bloody every single colour you can think of for a sunrise and I've just gone on bloody mystic Good morning, sir. Good morning. See you standing on your own to be. You will wash away the wild. You will wash away. So we've got this 1970s Mamiya C330S uh, medium format camera. Six, uh, six by six exposures. I uh, got that. I'm using some. Um, of the HP5 Plus, which I'm going to push the stock today, um, just for that extra contrast it gives. Um, got this little beast, this is basically a Russian tank, a uh, Zenit uh, 12XP, um, famous for having the Helios lens, basically, um, which gives uh, the weird phenomenon of uh, a swirly boat, which hopefully will come out in the photos. Um, when I get them developed ASAP. I don't know a hell of a lot about film, uh, hence why I'm out here with Henry today. Um, I got my my little Olympus Trip 35, so I didn't even know the name of it, that's how bad it was. <laughs> um, I've got my uh, well, Mamiya C330 C TLR, which is uh, yeah, medium format, off the beast. I some black and white in this morning. Um, it's like I said before, I'm going to shoot it at double box speed. So I can bump the uh, apertures up in order to get uh, big depth of field. Let's give that a shot. What lens have you got on there today? I've got the uh, 80mm, which in full frame terms is probably about 50, um, which is basically the standard kit lens on most uh, medium format cameras. Standing on your own two feet, you will wash your I was just actually having a think the other, well actually last night, and I was like, you know sometimes you start thinking about like, you know, should I upgrade or should I not, and it's like, you know, do you actually need to, or is it just you would like to? I guess it's whether you know as well, it's whether you know, you know, whether you're actually going to make the money back, so you, if you're going to make a big investment, you want to know that you're actually making the money back in order to you know, pay it off, and that's why I think sometimes it's a bit scary investing into something that you really would like, but then can't necessarily pay it off, or pay it off within a long period of time. Let you fall away, you'll see, 
You will wash away the wild. You will wash away the wild. I see you standing on your own two feet. You will wash away the wild. You will wash away the wild. And if he runs a mile, he won't find. So we uh, decided to call it a day as the weather kind of took a turn. Even though it's not raining now, but um, when it's deteriorated. Yeah. It does rain, and it totally was not supposed to rain. Yeah, so uh, in that case, over and out. Ever over and out. That's, uh, I made a mistake of saying over and out. Out and over. No, just out or over. Right, I'm out. <laughs> no, that's not I'm out. I need to think of a uh, of something. Catch you guys in the next one. <laughs>